What's going on Final Fantasy family? Welcome back to another Ever Crisis video. Sorry guys, got a second keyboard here I gotta put away. Um, welcome back. Welcome back. I, I guess I should say that to myself as well too because I've been kind of away for a little bit. That's because there's not a lot going on. Let's be real. So a couple things I want to do right now. Uh, this is not going to be a guide video. I do want to talk real quick though to the C players and any Steam players that are brand new to the game or have been playing for some time and have not done the dungeons. Remember that all of the dungeon guides are on my channel. I know some of you guys have been asking about them and like whether I'm going to do them or not. Here's the thing. I've got S plus for all of them already that are out. They are all actually on the channel with even worse gear than now. So um, I suggest going back, searching for these, and just running it the exact same way. Use the same elements, whatever, but better weapons now obviously will help you even further in these stages. They haven't changed the difficulty of these in any way, shape, or form. The rewards are exactly the same. But with that being said, there is something exciting at least for dungeon um, goers here. We have the brand new Buster Sword. So make sure you pick this bad boy up, and we can go ahead now and get another copy of this in our repertoire and enhance this bad boy to, I think, what is it, OB7 now? I mean, man, we're going to get, yeah, OB7. This is crazy. Like, we're three months away from getting an OB10 Buster Sword. I swear I never thought I'd see this happen. But here we are moving along and getting our stats up every single time. So there you guys have it. There's an OB7. Now, next part of this, um, Easter Egg Hunt. I know a lot of you guys are currently either doing that or, you know, doing co-op mode, etc. cetera. Uh, the Easter Egg Hunt is a pretty straightforward fight. If you guys can equip the brand new summon that you got from Bahamut and, and um, Ifrit, you're in even a better position than, than I am. I don't have it equipped currently. I probably should because uh, I could level it up. But I'm using Hellfire currently and any form of other AoE summon to try to finish this off. Now, we do have a brand new story coming out today. Oh, it's actually out right now. There it is right there. And I'm, what I'm doing is I'm using a full built um, fire team essentially, with Yuffie, Cloud, and, and Sephiroth, and just kind of going in and doing as much damage as I possibly can on this on this mode, okay? So make sure you're doing this. Get yourself crystals. Now, the reason why I'm doing this right now with you guys is because I'm going to get some crystals, and we're going to go and summon. Um, we have literally two, two days. Two days, guys, before the whole anniversary banners, I believe, are done, right? Because it's April 2nd was the, ban was the banner. I have to go double check that. So I'm still in the hunt for at least one cloud sword, and I still don't have that one cloud sword. So we're going to go and try to get that one cloud sword, if possible, today. Outfits put aside. I know it sucks that I'm not going to get it, but I do want that P attack weapon, at least at an OB, at least, at least an OB zero. I'll be fine with the five star version of it just because I want that buff to be applied to all my team. Cause you guys can see here, I run mostly physical. Now I do have Sephiroth with his magic attack one, which I have been building and putting to use to some content. I believe we should be getting towers very soon. So brand new tower floors from 71 to 90, most likely should be coming in probably next week or the following. So we, we're, we're going to get new content eventually, and I'll be coming back, obviously, doing videos on that. But at the moment, as it stands, guys, it's just collecting crystals, logging in, doing dailies, making sure that I have enough of these to actually do a summon, doing some co-op to get some of the co-op modes out of the way, and then, obviously, turning the game off and, and hoping... Oh, actually, that's not true. I still do my daily summons as well, which is very important, okay? So there you guys go. So 438 out of 999. It's okay. We won't bother with that. What I wanted to show you guys, though, is the summon. Let's see what we get here, okay? Let's go check to see where we're at, actually, in terms of the 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 final date for these summons. I think it's I think it is. Oh, it's April seventh. My apologies, April seventh. So I still I still have nine days. My apologies, nine days, guys. Sorry to scare you guys. I thought it was April second for some reason. I'm losing my mind here. So April seventh is when it's said. Still not a lot of time, realistically, if you look at. It. I've got four thousand one hundred thirty gems remaining. We're gonna go ahead and draw. Um, let's see what happens here. I don't know why Norton's telling me there's a virus going on or some sort of a thing. Okay, so there's two there. What am I away from getting a guarantee? Oh, no, okay, I want... Are you kidding me, man? I need to just want... Okay, I have to be able to get another 2,000 crystals in order to get myself the guarantee. At least, the very least, the guarantee. And then I'm, I'm happy. I'll be happy enough with that. This anniversary has been atrocious for me when it comes down to actual, like summoning luck it's really set me back like it showed how human i am at the end of the day i think because i think that needed to happen as, as bad as it is i was telling some folks on discord like i think i needed to have a, a streak of bad luck for people to think okay you know it's possible that he, it's not rigged for him and it's not like just streamer luck so as much as it sucks for me it's kind of it's kind of refreshing to see a little bit of humanity in all this so there we go let's go let's get ourselves a nice weapon here let's get a couple let's get a couple five stars cloud yeah i think i think it's about time 
We've had really, really, really poor luck. Just cut me some slack here, guys. And quite honestly, guys, until until the new um, content comes out, what do we get? Yes, please, please, please. No, no, Sky Splitter probably. Oh my God, and I'm not complaining about Sky Splitter because I need them, but that's just garbage right there. Okay. Oh man. All right. Well, that's done. Whatever. It is what it is. Let's get this five star out of the way as well. We got a couple of tickets to go through here. Um, so yes, I was saying. Um, until we see the brand new tower floors, until we see which tower floors, quite honestly, don't even give enough content for this game because not, not a lot of people are interested in it. As much as people want to say they want to see it, when it when we drop the videos, like any content creator drops a video about a tower, ain't nobody care. We know because the views aren't there, right? So we'll see how much content we get out of that. Now, the guilds, on the other hand, which I believe is still happening on week seven, is what I'm mostly interested in because I want to see what we're going to be getting from a guild perspective and how it's going to work and how it's going to run Crystal Cross. Okay, that's cool. I think this was a decent weapon, if I recall. I don't even remember this weapon now, to be honest with you guys. I'll have to go double check. I think I have a five-star copy of that, though. So, yeah, um, guilds will be a big one. Now, remember, if you are not currently in a Discord for this game, my Discord is fairly active for Final Fantasy VII Never Crisis. It's been a little quieter, obviously, because Easter weekend. Uh, happy Easter, by the way. Um, and, other, and other reasons why, obviously, because a lot of our veterans are currently just kind of waiting for new content to drop. But we already have a guild system set up. We have guild leaders already assigned. So if you're looking for a pretty active casual guild and a pretty active competitive guild, we're, we're probably going to have a little bit of both. So feel free to jump on and join at any time. Discord is always in the description below. Just make sure when you jump onto the Discord, you get yourself the uh, roll for... Ooh, look at that. See? The reason why I do five sometimes. Another Lucia weapon. Man, they love giving me Lucia right now. Okay, so we got a couple Lucias here. Um, so yeah, feel free to jump on, and you guys can read up on all the plans we have for, for the guilds, and feel free to join one at any time. We have amazing... and like Literally, I kid you not, probably the best community I've ever been a part of. Um, I'm slowly starting to obviously get into the solo leveling arise community, which also I have the same discord for obviously f feel free to join for that because I know a lot of you watch me for that as well. But for Final Fantasy, it's the most mature, laid back, respectful, yet fun community you'll ever meet. So shout out to my to the guys at the Final Fantasy 7 Ever Crisis Discord, including the mods and obviously everyone who always participates in chatting, just having a good time. Um, Again, if you're looking for a home, guys, and a, a good community gaming home, the Discord's always open with you with open arms. Just be respectful when you join. That's all I ask for. Uh, and just, you know, just be open-minded with some crazy jokes, some really fun people, and just having a really good time at the end of the day, right? Okay, so there you guys go. That is the completion there. I don't think I've seen a black, or a, a black, a, a, a B-level chocobo. I don't know if that black. I think maybe I've seen a black chocobo recently. Even if they, I don't even think they exist. I think that was on Final Fantasy's uh, Seven Rebirth. Maybe OG. Anyways, um, yeah, haven't seen a B-level Chocobo drop once yet. I've only got the one that we got for free from completing quests. That's also something that's been eluding me quite a bit. But uh, there you guys go. That's pretty much it. So again, not much content for veteran players going on. We just have that one event, obviously, that we're all doing right now, which is going to either net us some nice little tickets, some free rewards, and obviously the gather system is available for us. But outside of that, guys, just same old, same old, all right? So I'll do my best to as soon as something new drops to bring you guys some content. But until then, I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.